Hey, it's your result gate 22 here. Well, let's get to my predictions for tomorrow's spooky event. And I'm talking about NXT Halloween Havoc. Oh, I'm getting excited for that. Hey, Halloween's one of my favorite, ho Halloween's one of my favorite holidays. <laughs> okay, let's get to the match. And first, it's going to be Apollo Crews versus, oh, idiot, Grayson. And a spin the wheel made the deal. <laughs> oh, this is going to be fun. Well, come on, you know how it's done. Ever since Apollo decided to go back to NXT, and and Grayson just had the usual yap, 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 yap. And when, when last time they faced each other, Grayson used, I don't know what it was, was it pepper spray or something that blind or fuck the eye that got him to win. Huh. And because of that, he Apollo did a little mind game of his own against Grayson. I know that was not real blood in his uh, dropping off. I was like, that was just makeup. I know that, but still fun. <laughs> well, Grayson did got a taste of his own medicine. <laughs> Sucker. But no, but this time, oh, anything can happen when that when that wheel spins. It could be anything. It could be anything. So depends what it is. Depends what the stipulation is gonna be. I'm waiting for Apollo to win. Come on, you. Come on, Grayson. You forgot about Paul Cruz. Former United States champ, former Intercontinental champ. <laughs> so even, well, goes to win. Okay, this match is gonna be a bit interesting and oh boy. <laughs> and then take the Julius Creed from the Creed Brothers takes on the, the, the betrayal, <laughs> Damon. <laughs> but this time, it's gonna be an ambulance match. Oh, I can't remember. Oh yeah, last time we had an ambulance match was two years ago. <laughs> was it? Was it? I can't remember. Cause I, meant, I think it was two years ago. Because I meant it was Drew and Randy. And then his match. Oh, well, you know how it's done. The betrayal. <laughs> Since Damon took out each me two me members of the Diamond Mine, so he's been wanting to get rid of them for good. And even more in separation for this. Like, if Drew lose, if he lose, his brother has to leave NXT. Ugly. <laughs> Ugly. I'm praying, I am praying that Julius win, wins this. Time to show the betrayal you don't mess with brothers. <laughs> okay, next hole. Oh, another betrayal. <laughs> From best friends to more enemies. I'm talking about Corey J takes on Lux and, and it, it's not a spin the wheel made a deal, but this time it it's it's going to be a weapons wild match. Whoa, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Because, come on, you know how it started after they won the NXT Women's Tag Team titles. And all of a sudden, Fox then decided to get, week, a week after, she decided to get, have a women's ta title shot. But Tom said tried to get a tag to But then, Chloe was about to step in. But Fox came back. The match happened. But then, this, the, the, the betrayal happened. Cool. That was not, did I expect it? Chloe <laughs> uh, turned to the dark side. Betrayal. And then they've been going out there. And now they're going to get out to more in this we weapons wild match. <laughs> okay, even though they tried to pick the point. They didn't pick the point in the match. Huh. I'm waiting for Roxanne to win this. So you show Koi, you don't betray your best friends. Doesn't mean I never betrayed Danielle. We've been friends since we were kids. I'll never do that to her. I'll never hurt her. So like I said, I want Roxanne to win. <laughs> Next, we got a ladder match for the fake kids and next thing, North American title. Oh, you think I never forget the first time they did that back in 2018? That was incredible. And now, I think, no, I, you know what? I think the North American Championship championship match is better in a ladder match because it's more and more fun. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, okay, so we got <laughs> Kamambo. He's a. Well, he was a former champion, but then he lost to almost, but then almost got moved to SmackDown, and he had to vacate the title. Then he takes on Wes Lee and Von Wagner with Misty Stone. I had a little Twitter, Twitter and Instagram battle with him a couple weeks. <laughs> I, don't know. I guess that will happen. Says, says Mr. Stone, you did get beat up by a girl. <laughs> Then, okay. Oh, yeah, almost. The guy from NXT U UK. <laughs> and Nathan. Okay, here's who I think's gonna win. Who I, who I really want to win. Okay, if Nathan wins, I'll be okay with it. It'll be good. If Wes we wins, I'll be like, yeah! And especially if Olo wins, I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. 
Just don't like because I'm the win back the title or oh, oh, Bond win it, especially I'm the one of his throwing space going. Ah! <laughs> oh, you villa. Here's my prediction. It, what if Mr. Stone tried to get, try to climb the ladder? He tried to reach it. Or either, why don't the competitors stop him? Or the fear, fear stops, stops him. Oh, I would love how to <laughs> magic power smash him again, especially on a ladder. <laughs> I get over, I get over, I get over. But that's a lot F for me. <laughs> okay, next we got we oh Manny Rose versus Alba Fire for for the NXT women's title. I can't wait, it's been a, a year. A year. At Halloween Havoc since Mandy won that title. <laughs> I can't wait it's been a year. At Halloween Havoc since she won that title. But this time, she's gonna lose it this time. Yeah, true, she's got her toxic attraction and Sonya. <laughs> Big whoop. Because you're not taking on an ordinary woman. You're taking on a big fire phoenix from Glasgow, Scotland. You don't mess with Glasgow girls. <laughs> so, I want. After those, she was the longest reign NXT UK Women's Champion. Hey, well. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, so I would I would win this. I think it's time for her to be, be champion again. But if Toxic and Sonya does show up, oh, I will burn them down <laughs> like a phoenix. Next, oh, this is I think this is gonna be a good one, and I think it was gonna be a triple threat match. Yep, triple threat match for the NXT title as Braun Breaker defends his title against Dragon Off <laughs> and JD McDonald. <laughs> is it me or JD is coming like Sasha Bob? Because you know, all the things he does is he wipe, like cutting his finger of blood and sign it. <laughs> Jeez, use a pen. Okay, so like I said, either Bond Breaker retains or Dragonov wins. <laughs> Come on, if Dragonov wins, he'll be, be a complete fool. So I'll go find him when like to be a champion against this. He didn't lost. He didn't lost the NXT UK title. <laughs> oh, please. I just don't want you to win if he wins. But here's the other plot twist. As you may saw, saw in NXT on Wednesday. Fear, Austin Fury. Ah! He show up. They think he's going to show up and cash it in. And pray he feels praise. Because oh, come on, Winnie. One, he should not be in that Money in the Bank running match. Two, he should not want it. And three, like I said, I'm praying he feels. He feels. Praise. So, stay for my prediction. One break retains or Dragon Off wins. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's my predictions. I will do a reaction to some of the matches tomorrow. And maybe get a little bit, get into a Halloween spirit as well while I watch it. <laughs> yeah, what you gotta do is Halloween month. <laughs> Love Halloween. Okay, so, uh, right, so, okay, so, wait until tonight. I will do a SmackDown reaction. I will not miss it this time. Even if I have to wait till the morning to do it. I will do one. Then, let's see, then... Halloween Havoc tomorrow. Oh no, Sunday? Doctor Who! Ah! Yeah, it's Johnny Redskill's final episode. I need to react to it. Not just the episode, the episode and the regeneration. <laughs> Alright, so, yeah, you later.